Hey everybody, we're gonna do the update for the week here. We've got uh, mom and dogs going in and out, so they'll probably be in and out during these videos, going outside to use the restroom while we uh, while we shoot the video of all the pups. We're gonna do just a general run through, uh, much like we did the first week, and. Uh, I got somebody learning how to growl early. Hey, little buddy. We'll go through and give you at least, you know, a few minutes on each litter. See, all the tails have been docked. Abby's pups were born. Their tails have not been docked yet, but everybody else's has. Do calls removed. And I got all the individual collars on everybody. Everybody's eyes are open. Yeah. And green over there. Exercising his domain. Go outside, Jenny. Blue is pretty big. Blue and red. Way too early to, to you know determine pick of the litter, but blue and red's pretty big. Oh, look at you. It don't take long from this point. It's like um, usually right when they start getting close to three weeks of age, they'll they'll all start nibbling on food and drinking water, and when they hit three, it's just bam, you know, they just start going up real fast. They'll double in size almost every single week after they start drinking uh, water and eating food. Plus getting that little bit of share of their mother's milk. Hey, you learning to bark real early. You probably gonna be an alpha male. Yeah. girls and this Jenny litter is, is a neon green, pink, and purple. And then obviously the boys are green, red, and blue. Lulu, go outside. These aren't your puppies. I'm gonna start a fight. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, film Lulu's now. They're actually a little bit bigger than Jenny's. You know, they're a few days older than Jenny's, so. Uh, it's exact, exactly the same thing. Every one of y'all knocked it out. Now, in this litter, we have seven. It's uh, just a reminder, four boys and three girls. Hey. I'll scare you and wake you up. And in this litter, the collars are pretty much the same. The only difference is uh, we have a black collared boy. Black, red, blue, dark blue, and light blue. And then we have neon, orange, pink, and purple for the girls. Lulu, go outside. Yeah, it's just busted that door right in my back. But basically, you know, you, you'll use these colored collars. Uh, no matter which list you're on to go through as they as they progress and next week we'll start really seeing a, a lot lot more difference in all the pups because they'll be all walking around and you know eating food drinking water they're all start they'll be more like you no know, actual puppy puppy stage by then um, and right now you know they're just in that transitional stage let's see who we got big yeah red's definitely the biggest no, I don't know. Red and blue is pretty big in this one too. The girls are all relatively about the same size right now. So, hey, buddy. Yeah. yeah. And uh, just going through, you know, list. If you're looking to join one of our list, you got a lot of options with these. Uh, these currently four different litters and I'll give just a general you know breakdown um, 
of course it's on the site but just a summarized version you know coming off the video uh, Gideon and Jenny um, if you're wanting a Gideon pup go with that if you're more looking for more of that lean muscular you know blockhead look you're gonna get that no matter which litter you join from us so let's just kind of throw that out there on any litter um, you'll get that you know real muscular lean looking uh, Weimaraner with a good blockhead look uh, but Jenny's gonna have a little bit more family oriented than Abby's pups and uh, on the contrary which you'll see in this next video we'll do Abby's newborns uh, Abby's gonna be just the ultimate you know if you're looking for that outgoing lead dog and uh, trainable dog that's gonna really just kind of be geared you know showing off and doing their thing whether you hunt or not that's definitely the, the litter you want to go with. Uh, this litter that I'm filming now is sired by Bentley. And if you're going for, uh, there's definitely some differences in Bentley and Lulu versus Bentley and Chloe, more so than even Jenny and Abby in comparison. Uh, and that litter, I mean, in this litter, uh, you're gonna, you know, you're gonna get a large dog, you know, very muscular, lean, blockhead look in the Chloe and, and Lulu, but definitely, uh, I mean, tremendously geared for the family in this litter. Uh, then Chloe, Chloe's going to be real rock solid. You're, you're probably going to get the biggest dog probably from Chloe. Uh, you'll still get the really good family orientation. Probably a little bit more lead dog uh, there. And then of course there's blues and Chloe, blue female. So if you're looking for a blue, you'd want to go go with that litter. Um, I just can't go wrong. I mean, that's the good thing is you got options with us and. And uh, that's good because uh, when it comes down to narrowing it down, you're, you're, you'll be able to really go through and do a uh, <coughs> and make a wise decision in your choice as far as picking out a puppy. You know, is this something you're signing up for for the next you know, 10 to 15 years? And we want to make sure you're making making the right choice as well. So we got the three boys here and uh, one girl. She had six originally, but two of them were runts and they didn't make it past two days. And this is actually the day we will dock the tails and do claws on this litter. So, let's see which one's the girl so we can single her out. Well, it's got to be you. I picked up four of them. There you are. It's the big one. That's very rare. Big fat puppy's the female. We'll jump over and feature Chloe's right now, as you know. It's just really not much to see yet. Abby. Abby being a good mama. Hey, Chloe. Alright, we get to get some blue action. No, going. I'm not giving you no love right now. We gotta film the puppies. Hey, puppies. I want to wake up. I'm gonna pull a uh, red collar out here because he's actually the Sammy and Bentley pup that Chloe's raising since she only had one, and he's a few days older than the rest. So you're gonna see him progress through the videos a little bit, a little bit quicker than the others. Hey, little buddy. No, Chloe, no. Hey, look at you. See, this is more the true three-week stage right here. And then we got the blues, all the blue girls. If it's a blue in this litter, it is a girl. Hey! Hey, Chloe. What you doing? Let's get the silver boy real quick. You can tell these are Chloe's pups. Chloe's, Chloe's pups are always fat. <laughs> fat, chubbly, wrinkly, they look like little bears. It'd be awesome if you could just keep a keep a dog like that. It just stays just like that. You can tell just looking at this litter. Compared to the rest, they're uh well fed. <laughs> Alright, we'll cut the video and have an update for you next week.